Okay guys, I'm gonna get down here. There's my dumped exhaust, but it still has the resonator on there. So in the cab, it's not bad at all. No drone. I mean, you can hear me talk just as plain as day. It's not bad inside the cab. It's a clean sound. There's no raspiness. Okay, I'm gonna give you guys a sound clip of in the truck. I do have my window down on the driver's side. But it's totally manageable it's not loud in the car or the truck I should say I'll roll the window up just so you guys can I don't have the radio on and I'm getting on it a little bit I mean it's it's actually just a little bit louder than the muffler so if you're on the fence about worried if it's going to be raspy, listen to this. Sounds really similar to a Flowmaster outside. So for those guys that tell you that, oh man, the cabin noise will be unbearable, the drone and all this. No, there's no drone in here. I'm talking with the radio off. And that's where they dumped exhaust the pipe does not go out the back so that's really what the whole video is about is showing everybody that i modified my i originally done a muffler delete and loved the sound so i wanted it a little bit deeper so i cut the pipe off and done a dump and it really didn't change anything all that much so i just saved a little weight so there we go guys all right i'm outside the truck right now i'll give you guys a start up it is not a cold start so i love it it really has a similar similar sound to the Flowmaster, but uh you know for me i recommend keeping the resonator because I've heard many people say if you delete the resonator and the muffler, it gets really raspy. Um, so I don't know, but I'm, I'm happy with what I've done. So I believe I'm gonna stop there, quit while I'm ahead, so to speak.